While fans hope that the Badgers are stars on the court tonight, you may have seen that UW coach Bo Ryan starring in an ad that's airing pretty heavily in the Midwest right now. But you may not know that three famed UW alumni are behind it. Hey, they say that art what the heck's going on out there? imitates life. But these directors will tell you that's not so simple. You know, curiously enough, you know, a lot of our direction to Bo was, you have to be angrier. <laughs> Jim Abrams and David Zucker have a bit of experience getting their actors to ham it up. Can you fly this plane and land it? Surely you can't be serious. I am serious. And don't call me Shirley. Making Hello, fan favorites like Airplane and The Naked Gun, they're also UW alumni, which they show off proudly. This was the first year that University of Wisconsin had photo IDs, and so we all thought they were trying to identify us in an anti-war protest. They've also got Wisconsin roots, both originally from the Milwaukee area. And I think that we just had fun kind of ripping on each other when we were in high school, and that you know, that Shorewood wasn't a tough high school in a physical sense, but I think in a verbal sense, you had to have a quick comeback for something. Yeah, I mean, the, the, the choices were have fun at the other guy's expense or do your homework. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it was pretty clear. That loyalty to Wisconsin has led them to make multiple ads recently for the State Department of Tourism, including the most recent spot featuring a fun-loving Coach Ryan who was also a fan of their movies. After a recent emergency landing on the team plane, he quickly spouted a famous line. I picked the wrong week to quit sniffing blue. We're not surprised, because he, he is that kind of guy. He's, you know, the, often these guys aren't, I mean, you think of him as this just angry coach, but <laughs> he's, he's got a sense of humor. Coach Ryan calls the whole experience what? unique. I had to do a lot of takes, uh, not because I flubbed my lines, but they, they knew they wanted something, so they would have me make all these different facial expressions matching that, me making faces. What? They were really funny, and uh, they actually said to me, they liked the way, they, they liked the job I did, so I'm supposed to take uh, is it Leslie Nielsen's place in the, next, uh, in the next movie, so I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the offer and the contract. I'll have to get my agent and see what we can do. We're willing to say virtually anything to get a performance from someone. Yeah, or, so, or, or, or short of that, just to get a laugh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just because we were desperate for attention. But when you think about it, in fact, you know, what Bo did is not distant from what Leslie did. In other words, and all the, the guys in, in, um, in Airplane, they were essentially having a laugh at their own expense. They're the making fun of their of own the, image. Right. right. And he, Bo is definitely doing that. Yes. So you're not going to promise him another part after this, is what you're saying? He's <laughs> no, he's, he's finished. Oh, cool. yeah. Okay. Yeah, he should just stick to coaching, I think. Yeah. Just so we're clear, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We should know that this ad was also made with David's brother, Jerry Zucker, who unfortunately wasn't in town that we could talk to him this week. But they say this partnership goes all the way back generations. Their fathers, the Abrams and the Zuckers, were partners in real estate back in Milwaukee. In Los Angeles, Jessica Arp, WISC News 3.